Good morning. And what a lovely morning it is. We've got some blue sky after yesterday's pouring rain. Anyway, the plan for this wee break is that uh, we are heading to the Scottish borders. Uh, we're going to go from here, take the 77 onto the M8, uh, through the Edinburgh Bypass and make our way towards North Berwick. After North Berwick, we're going to travel along the coastline and we're going to head towards Dunbar. Uh, staying with the coast, uh, we're going to be heading towards um, Eye mouth and then uh, through Burnmouth, uh, head down towards Berwick upon Tweed, and uh, then we'll head to Gordon where our accommodation is. We'll get a lovely wee uh, cottage booked for um, a few days. Uh, so, if you're interested in any of that, then uh, get in and uh, come along and join us. Two hours of motorway traffic and 74 miles brings us to North Berwick. I did spare you the motorway journey, don't mention it. Anyway, Michelle's first call of point of interest is the Scottish Seabird Centre and that's where we're heading now. As you can see, we've arrived to some lovely sunshine weather and blue skies. I the bird. Long to be a river. Right, Michelle was very keen to see puffins while we're here. So I'm going to show you guys a puffin the now. There you go. Puffin. And that is a big puffin. That is probably the biggest puffin you're ever likely to see. Yeah, we've just left um, North Berwick and we're heading towards St Amps. Right, arrived at St Amps. If you're coming here, make sure. Hmm? Again. <laughs> Not a lot against it. St Abs Head, right, if you're coming here, make sure you've got plenty of change for parking. Three pound per car. And I saw a lady trying to put a card in the machine and it didn't work. So let that be a lesson to you. Don't say you've not been told. That is lovely around here, isn't it? Is it down this way, Michelle? Hmm? Is it down this way? Have you not been here before? Mm -hmm. Can't remember? Yeah. Michelle was here 20 years ago, but she can't remember the way. What a short memory. We'll just follow the yellow brick road. Right, the footpath to St. Ab's Head, that's uh, a good sign. I don't even remember any of this. All ability path. So, where we go up? Where'd they go? The uh, pass. Huh? Was that a path down here? This is uh, a little confusing as to where the path starts, but if you're a dummy, that is like me. But this looks like an obvious bet here. No 
tuon tuon. Yeah, I thought um, they probably wouldn't be allowed the drone being a nature reserve and all. I mean, that's your standard, which is uh, fair enough. You don't want to go disturbing the, the wildlife that are all nesting and flying about. I the river now Long to be the sea When I become the sea I'll cry for the clear gold stream As I drown in the dark blue deep Okay people that was St Ab's Head So onwards and downwards to the harbours Oh, by the way, if you're coming here, um, if you're prone to have a dislike towards flies, I mean big flies, um, stay well away because there's lots of them. Uh, huge, massive things fly all around about you and stick a heading in on it. And uh, if you're scared of heights, um, be careful. It's maybe not the place to come if you're scared of heights. My legs were going to jelly. Was your legs going to jelly standing there on the end? No? Yeah, it's just me. I must be a bit of a wuss. That was so my sensible. <laughs> I felt my legs going to jelly. So it's quite high up, so do be careful, people, if you're coming clumsy here. Clumsy like me. Yeah, if you're clumsy, especially, hold on to somebody. Take them with you. <laughs> anyway, we'll see you soon. So I'll rise up And I'll fall back down to land I the burn The small and scenic vein of the river With the duty to deliver down Through the river to the sea To become a thing less free I should turn But I don't want to be the sea I'm scared for I'll sink too deep And I can rise up And fall back down Right, I wish we had been filming because we have just done the most damnedest thing. Oh, you? Hi. <laughs> yeah, I've arrived here in uh, Gordon, uh, just having came from uh, Berwick upon Tweed after a lovely coffee. Um, lovely place for a, for a walk, by the way, but um, hey, we'll come back to that later. Anyway, we're here in Gordon. Now, apparently, the Airbnb we're staying in is uh, four houses down from the local shop. Well, it's four doors down east. But what I done was I went west and walked straight into some old women's house. Our door was open. Lovely lady. Walked into her living room. Fortunately, she's from Wales and she was absolutely wonderful. Um, what an amazing person. Didn't mind one bit that we walked into our living room. <laughs> Com two complete mental strangers. <laughs> anyway, yeah, she was lovely. Been living here since 1998 or something. 
Anyway, here we are, look, if you're ever coming for Airbnb and Gordon, the door has actually got a sign that says Cycles, Rifles and Rods. Um, so, you know how to find it. So let's go in here and hopefully we won't meet any strangers. Oh yeah. Right, this looks like the Airbnb. It definitely resembles. The pictures. It's got a visitor book there. Yeah, Oof! <laughs> Honestly, how embarrassing. I mean, it's not the first time I've done that. If you've watched any of my videos before, when uh, me and some of the boys were over in Northern Ireland, I walked into the wrong place um, as well. We got a habit of doing that now. <laughs> Fortunately, um, there was no one running about naked just having come out of the shower or anything like that uh, the last time either. God forbid, can you imagine? Anyway, this place looks all right. It's got hot water bottles in case you're cold. Oh, and that's a, a wee self-care and kitchen. Which Great, looks we've nice got and our nice food. and clean. Oh yeah, the bedroom area, bathroom. Oh. Yeah, we know it. To use the shower, Need take shower it. head down and turn on water. Oh yeah, it's um, gravity fed. Yeah, lovely and clean. Uh, nice. The bedroom. The bedroom. Hot water this is where all the action happened, guys. But you'll not be privy to any of that. <laughs> Sorry to disappoint you. Paul and Mrs. Paul. <laughs> Paul and Mrs. Paul. <laughs> lovely. Oh, oh, oh how sweet. sweet. Hot water bottles. I'm hoping it's not going to get that cold. That we're going to need them. That might be a happy anniversary card. Does she know it's her anniversary? Could I tell her? I don't know. That's a happy birthday. Happy anniversary. Oh. Hope you enjoy this wee corner of the planet, Amanda. Oh, oh that's, that's sweet. So sweet. Thank you very much, Amanda, if you ever watch this video. Oh, that's lovely. That's great. What have we got in here? Don't dare me open bloody some of these doors in case I walk into somebody else's living room. <laughs> right, no, this is just a, a bunker. Oh, garden. The garden. garden. The mud room. This Gardens. is the mud room. Hang your rods here. No got any rods. Or your hat. Oh, look at the garden. You can hang your hat here. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, loads of character, this girl, isn't it? Look at that. Right, that's somebody else's house, Paul. Right, noted. Oh, is that Wow. Yeah. Very nice. Oh, that is very nice and cosy. Oh, yeah. Nice. Well, do you know what would really make? Oh, that's got a fire pit here as well, isn't it? I was just thinking there, a wee fire pit would just be the, the absolute ticket. ticket. And look as well, Michelle, look, they've got a, a burner up the back. Oh, that's right, she said there's logs. Oh. <clears throat> this is great, this will be. This will be lovely to sit out tonight and have a couple of wee drinks. Yeah. Even if it does rain, it's Fun. sheltered as well. Oh, that is so pretty. Pretty? Listen to me, pretty. What's that all about? It's pretty. We got things actually. Oh, look, tadpoles. Oh, yeah, we'll see some frogs hopefully. Anyway, we'll go and get settled in, guys. We'll talk to you later. Jungles I've been for in the end, for water we'd all rain. And now I stay for the souls who depend in the form of a man until his end. So I
Good morning. Um, this is the uh, Wednesday, second day of our wee trip down the Scottish borders. <coughs> uh, it's the 10th of May, our wedding anniversary. Nine years together. <laughs> hey, we've just had breakfast at uh, Purdy Lodge, uh, Adderston Services. Hmm? You did? Great. Uh, Nice wee place, uh, Cafe One, it's called, it's open 24-7, quite near Bamber Castle. Um, so if you're along this way and you're looking for some brekkie, this is the place to come. Anyway, we're going to head uh, to Bamber Castle uh, this morning uh, via the coast road. Uh, so we'll see you over there. Well, as you can see, We've arrived at Bambra Castle.
Good morning. What another fine morning it is. Thursday the 11th of May. Uh, woke up in Gordon this morning. Um, day before we're due to go home. Uh, packed quite a lot in yesterday and day before. So, as you'll have seen by the video. Alright, we've arrived at Dryber Abbey. No drones allowed here. One of the rules by Historic Scotland, even though Ian, the guy that sold us the tickets, was a very nice gentleman. Not his decision. So we'll just film. More of a nice wee look around, um, but no aerial footage for these, I'm afraid. Okay, ready? Nice bit of light coming in the back of the abbey there. The sun is trying to come out. But yeah, this is nice. Very peaceful. Melrose Abbey is uh, fenced off as well, uh, but we might be able to get a couple of pictures if nothing else. Well, for another lovely day. Today, as you can see, the sun is shining. Yeah, we're hiding from it. <laughs> we're hiding from it because it's too hot. I don't, I don't have a sun cream. Yeah, we got, um, as you'll see by the footage uh, on the camera and the drone, um, most of the stuff was kind of filmed in cloud, unfortunately. Um, but much better than rain, I suppose. Uh, in hindsight, it would have been better to go out uh, this afternoon and uh, do the, the round that we done, but uh, we didn't, but never mind. We're just relaxing now back at the Airbnb and the garden, as you can see. Uh, a few drinks, bit of dinner. Um, we get a wee fire pit going tonight. And uh, we'll head home tomorrow to what we believe is sunshine again, so. Unless there's anything exciting on the way home tomorrow. Uh, thanks for joining us if you've made it this far. Well done. Uh, it's goodbye from me. It's goodbye from Michelle. I'm Basil. Do you know? I'm Basil. <laughs>